This is the Baofeng UV5R, widely known throughout the entire ham radio community as the best radio you can buy. And it has only one weakness. It's a handheld and it outputs only four watts, if you're lucky. But I'm gonna show you how you can turn this little weakling into a 40 watt powerhouse. Powerhouse of transmitting power. Now right up front, this is not some kind of hack or weird trick to magically make your UV5R start transmitting 40 watts. If you came here looking for something for free, go away now. Otherwise, stick around and I'll show you how to turn your little 4 watt radio into a 40 watt powerhouse. Pow. I will do my best to keep this video short and to the point. I don't want to waste your time going off on tangents talking about other things. But first, allow me to digress. If you're a regular viewer, you may have noticed this. This is not my vestigial twin brother growing out of the side of my neck. Although I can see how you might make that mistake. This is a microphone. You've probably seen them before on other YouTubers channels. And it's here suddenly where you can see it because I want to give you, my favorite viewer, the best audio and sound experience possible. If you watch my videos, you've probably noticed over the last few months, a lot has changed. The room has changed. The camera's changed. The microphone has changed. And I've been struggling to get that audio to the level that I know you, my favorite viewer, demand. So I finally broke down and talked to my friend Lenny B, who is an audio engineer, and asked him if he could help improve my audio and my sound for you, my favorite viewer. Lenny B has got a YouTube channel. I'll put a link below and a website, LennyB.com, where he teaches people how to get the best audio with what they have. Not He doesn't tell you to go out and buy a bunch of expensive stuff. He helps you work with what you've got. And he did a great job of stepping me through not only how to use my equipment, the right way, what the, all the little buttons and switches mean, but he helped me to get the best sound possible. This is it, this is as good as it's gonna get. So if you're a YouTuber and you need help with your audio, check out Lenny B's YouTube channel. He's got some great free tutorials. I'll put a link below. If you like the way this sounds, leave a comment below, let me know, let Lenny know. If you go check out his channel and some of his videos, leave a comment there, let him know that the Not Rubicon sent you. Moving on to why you're actually here. First, I am required to explain Some of the legalities of using your UV5R. You can listen to anything you want with your UV5R, but if you're going to transmit, you need to know the rules. The UV5R is not legal to transmit on GMRS frequencies, even if you have a GMRS license. UV5R is not legal to transmit on MERS frequencies. UV5R is not legal to transmit on marine band frequencies. The UV5R is legal to transmit on ham bands only if you have a ham radio operator's license. So now that all the sad hams are happy and everybody is clear on the legalities of using the UV5R, the best radio known to mankind ever invented, now this video will be a little bit different because I don't actually have what I'm going to show you today. I can't afford, you know, people are always asking me, can you review this radio, this radio? Sure, I can. If you want to send one to me, I'm not rich. I can't afford to be buying all this stuff. I'm just some YouTube hobo making videos in his basement. Now you can help support me and the channel. I won't beg, but if you want more information, there's a link there with more information about how to join the channel, be a member, get certain perks. Even though I don't have this device, I can show it to you through the magic of highly sophisticated CGI computerized graphics. CGI stands for Common Graphic Interface. I know I'm a computer expert, so I know these things. I once worked in the fast food industry. I can show you right here. And if I didn't tell you that this wasn't real, you probably wouldn't have even noticed. I bet your mind is blown. This is the BTEC AMP U25 amplifier. Affiliate link below. 
And what this little box does is it will turn your skinny little four watt high school girl of a radio into a fully voluptuous 40 watt MILF. I'll put a link to this below, an affiliate link. You need to buy the right version depending on what frequencies you're gonna be talking on. They make them in several different versions, in different frequency ranges. They all cost pretty much the same. And it will work on any handheld radio that has a removable antenna like the UV5R. It doesn't matter the brand name, as long as it's got the type of antenna that you can remove, you can plug it in. It's like an inline linear type amplifier. And it comes with all the cables and everything that you need to connect it up. Now it's made to use in a car as a mobile, to, to basically turn your UV5R into a mobile radio. So it comes with mounting brackets and a cigarette lighter adapter plug to plug into your 12 volt source in the car. But you can easily use it in your home to make your UV5R into a a base station, a base station UV5R. All you would need is a 12 volt power supply and you will need a better antenna. You cannot use it with the existing antenna. You can use any mobile antenna tuned for the frequencies that you're going to be transmitting on. I'll put an affiliate link below to one of the Nagoya antennas that BTEC recommends, but any mobile type or even base station type antenna will work. The only requirement is that your radio has to transmit between four and six Watts. It has a built-in speaker. You can connect a regular, uh, Microphone with a cable, you know, breaker breaker one nine type microphone, so that you don't have to keep picking up the whole radio to transmit. So it really will turn your UV five R into a, a base station or a full mobile high powered radio. So that's it. I just wanted to tell you about this device. This really isn't a review. It's more like a public service announcement. I just wanted to let you know this was out there. I learned about it from listening to a guy using one on one of the repeaters, one of the GMRS repeaters that I listened to. He was talking on it. It sounded great. I could hear him fine. He's been using his for quite a while and hasn't had any issues with it. And when I heard about it, I thought about you, my favorite viewer. I wanted to let you know about it. It's not cheap, but if you already have a UV5R and don't want to spend a whole lot of money on a whole new radio, this might be just what you've been looking for. It's got 4.4 stars out of five on Amazon reviews, so it can't be that bad. So if you have a UV5R or any handheld radio, as long as it's got a detachable antenna and you're looking for a little more bump in the trunk, this might be just what you're looking for to make your life complete. That's all I wanted to share. If you have any questions, if I left anything out, if I got anything wrong, leave a comment below. Dickhead questions or opinions will be pinned to the top for everybody to laugh at and make fun of you. So think twice before leaving a stupid comment, unless you have one of those little icon badges next to your name. That means you clicked that join button and you can say whatever you want. If you're a channel supporter, this channel is yours as much as it is mine. Almost. I'll do my best to answer any questions. If I can't, someone else will come by and answer them for me. They'll probably get it wrong. So bear that in mind. Thank you for watching. We hope to see you on the trip.